This is another episode of Weak Grapple Wrestling News. Um, this past week, we had some great wrestling as usual. Um, NWA had an event in Mexico, like a joint event with AAA. Um, uh, they had some pretty good, some pretty good matches, man, and yeah, pretty solid matches. And um, yeah, it was a pretty interesting event, you know, that they had. In other wrestling news, um, had some debuts this past week. In WWE, Cameron Grimes. Um, let's see, next week you got a um, pretty deadly taking on, I believe, the Brawling Brutes. You got the debut of Grayson Waller. Show the Grayson Waller effect. So, yeah, man, we got a. Another great week of wrestling coming up. Great, you know. Got another, got some more great shows coming up this week. Um, AEW. Um, another solid show. Uh, looking forward to Double or Nothing. Got a big four-way match coming up. You know, it was... MJF and Sammy Guevara, the Spanish God. But now you got Darby Allen and Jungle Boy Jack Perry included now. So, good stuff, man. Great stuff, man. Looking forward to double or nothing. But, um, Kenny Omega and John Moxley. What and dynamic performance by both guys. What an awesome, awesome match. Um, I believe they probably did way more than they should have. You know, as far as the blood, you know, being spilled. Maybe a little blood spilling, you know... I would have probably not have said much, but, or at least I probably wouldn't have thought much about it, but, man, that match was kind of brutal, man, kind of brutal, not very brutal, but kind of brutal, but, man, what a performance by both guys, man, you can't take away those guys, um, passion for the business man when it comes to professional wrestling so what a performance by both guys um impact wrestling uh trinity is going to make her in ring debut this coming thursday um man rhino was brutally attacked by Steve Macklin, man, like, it, it was crazy on Impact this past week, man, and then you had PCO, he came into, you know, onto the scene when Steve Macklin went to the back, and they got to scrapping, man, Steve Macklin and PCO, so that joint was crazy, man, so... Man, what a crazy week, man. Last week. So, yeah, man. As far as MLW, man, I still got to catch up, man. Like, I kind of been forgetting about Tuesday nights because once I watch NXT sometimes, it's like I just randomly just do whatever or <laughs> get off into something or whatever or be kind of just in chill mode, super chill mode or whatever. But I'll catch up on it, man. Uh, as far as what I know, um, 
I guess Hammerstone might still be the champion. I'm not even sure, man. But I will catch up on MLW. But other than that, man, looking forward to another great week of professional wrestling. And that's pretty much all. That's my take on last week, pretty much. Looking forward to the upcoming pay-per-views, though. Double or nothing. Night of Champions. Um, Impacts in pay-per-view. Looking forward to all of that, man. So, yeah. That's my take on last week. Mark Smooth out.